well it's peaceful out here but I can't get through we got a couple trees down blocking the trail I could just take the tractor and just push it out of the way but I think I'll cut it up for some firewood property lines over there someone put flags on the tree that fell so let me get that cleaned up we'll take it back and burn it the neighbors recently went through there and knocked a mess down and they knocked a couple right out of the ground here so I'm gonna clean this up we'll put on time-lapse it'll be a project All right, I'm gonna work my way over in here. See, they they brought dozers and skidders over, and when they were turning around, they just knocked trees down and left them. I don't know. That's not good forest management. This is a a forest company, and here's the property line. There's a barbed wire fence. How many years old that is? And over here is the property pen corner. See that? It's a big, big stake, three quarter with a cap on it. And if you look and get over here, kind of thick here, some beach growing. Um, if you look through here, right there is that big stump that knocked over. And if you can see, there's a log on it here. So I think when they knocked them over, some fell this way and gave it a little push, you know. Um, and then the property pin is right here, right there. And if you look up, right, got to look closely here, right there. We can get in on it. Got to find it again. There's a blaze mark. I don't want to be super picky, but I don't want to be over on a neighbor either. I gotta find it here. Um, let's see here. I think I'm off another five degrees. I think I'm, yeah, I'm over to the right a little bit farther. I got a little more than I thought. Um, let's see here. Not showing up on film. There's a orange stripe on a tree. And then there's a blaze mark. Let's see if I can see that. I think there's one right, right where I placed this. It's hard to show. That's a blaze mark. I'm gonna get up closer, I guess, and show you. And then you look down the other way and there's a, a stripe on a tree. So what I wanna do, back this out, is come down through the woods like we are be able to come to this corner and turn and go out over here over here's our path and so far we can't do it for two years or so with a four-wheeler and so 
that's the goal here. Some of this wood is kind of crappy. The one I'm cutting now is oak, but the center's got a little rot on it. It's probably good enough burning the garage there. Um, instead of just pushing it off the side and leaving it. Right here's a blaze, see that? See the red? They painted that as a corner tree. It's got three stripes. And then, check out this one. Pretty rotten. That's not gonna take a long fall down. But um, I just wanna get access into here. And this junk's all in the way. I don't know, it's quite a bit here. I wanna put it over on the property line. And that'll be a good indication when you're coming down through with the four wheeler, start turning, you know. All right, I got the corner cleaned. Right there's a the property pin. So we can come down. Right there's a blaze. So that's the property line. There's a big oak stump there. So I can sort of fit between that and the other tree, but I think we'll stay on this side for now. And I squeak over and go that way, back, get back on the trail. So ideally, I should come down and either get the chipper and grind this stuff up or just move it on the property line so I can get over onto our corner so I can use all of our land. And then any of the trees over on the neighbors, either way, I'm leaving them. And we got quite a bit of junk here, but I got a little load. Got some good oak on there, but other than that, it's crap. It's a nice piece of oak over there I want, but I got a full load. I'm gonna head out of here, the showers are coming. I got a little bit in, but now we can drive the wheelers all the way around. Thanks for watching. See you soon.